How about Oklahoma and TCU, Vince? That's coming up at noon Eastern time. Yeah, that'll be a good one. I think OU, I think OU wins the day. Yeah, I like the Sooners, too. I like the way Spencer Rattler played in the overtime game against Texas. Shows some moxie, uses legs effectively, too. I got the Sooners. Max Duggan's a man. I just wish they had some men in front of him to protect him a little bit yeah. more and give that him help. more opportunity. That would help. help. But too, uh, too little offense for TCU, OU wins. But against that OU defense, Duggan's going to make plays, uh, yep. running and throwing. I just think that Spencer Rattler, he's really grown up, I think, getting benched against Texas, helped him with his maturity. And I think uh, Coach Rattler's too much for TCU today. That's a great pick. Coach Riley is 4 0 against TCU by winning an average of 18 points per game. Make it 5 0. Oklahoma. Good pick, Herbstreit. Good pick. <laughs> All right, Oklahoma across the board. What about Oklahoma State? A big challenge from Iowa State coming in. Vince, neither team's lost a conference game. That's true. Look, he was a man at 40. He's a wise man now. You got to go with Oklahoma State. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. I, I tell you what, I like Oklahoma State in this game. Iowa State is going to play a tough game, but Oklahoma State's defense will be the difference. Go Cowboys. Me and Bear got this unlocked. All right, this is Iowa State. All right, this, <laughs> this is Brees Hall. Um, but Breezy. It was, it was a better running back than Tuba Hubbard this year, which you've seen. But Iowa State's got a good defense, too, by the way. So mm. I think I, I'll take uh, Iowa State. I, I'm with Dez with the defense. I think the Oklahoma State defense, veteran group, I think they're the difference. And also, Spencer Sanders coming back. People have kind of written him off, forgotten about his playmaking ability. Coach, I think Oklahoma State upsets Iowa State. Oh, I was upset Sorry, Oklahoma Bear. recently. Now you got that wrong, huh? Yeah. Oklahoma State. <laughs> now they upset Oklahoma State. Iowa State over number six. I was Oklahoma State. You got me all screwed up, Herb Bear, Street. Bear Bear talks so much about Iowa State, I feel like they're favored. I, <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've got a game of the Big Ten, Penn State and Indiana. What do you got, Vince? Boy, Indiana's been doing better, but I'm going to go with Penn State in this one. I'm going with Indiana. I think that they're going to score a lot of points. People, they're going to catch a lot of teams by surprise this year. Got the quarterback, Mike Penix. I like them. Hey, you didn't want them for your super dog, though? That would have been perfect. You should have been your super dog, man. <laughs> the coach picked them, right? Super yeah. Right. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm Penn State. I'm, I'm Penn State as well. I think Indiana does a good job of competing. Penix can make a lot of plays, yeah. but I like Penn State coach to, to win this one. Nice pick, Desmond. Nice pick. They're my upset special over number eight, Penn State, Indiana. Nice pick, Desmond. <laughs> Thanks, Coach. All I like the Penn I like State the cutout, too. Nebraska and Ohio State in just a few minutes. Vince, who you got? Buckeyes all day. Buckeyes. Justin Fields looking great. And, uh, you know, I, I think the Buckeyes are going to have a heck of a season. I think so, too, and so does everyone else think they're going to get off to a great start against Nebraska. Coming up in just a few minutes, that's coming from the Horseshoe, and then tonight here in Minneapolis, it'll be Michigan and Minnesota. You know, that little brown jug when Fielding Yost bought it cost 30 cents, three lousy dimes. Now, capturing that thing will be priceless. First things first, the brown jug, you know, that's got to stay home, that's got to stay here. I know how important that the trophies are here, so it would mean everything to bring it back. We've had our foot on the gas here since June 15th, and we haven't stopped. We're confident in ourselves, and we're excited to have an opportunity to compete for the little brown jug. I know that we're ready, I believe that we're ready, and you know, I just can't wait to show the world what we got. So who gets a little brown jug tonight, Desmond? I tell you what, when you look at Michigan's offense, everyone's focused on Joe Milton. Watch the running backs. Check out a guy named Blake Corum, too. Young running back, very explosive. I got the Wolverines, David. I got no clue who's going to win the game, so I'm going with Tanner Morgan, the experience of the offense. I just, I'm going to ride with them. I don't know what I'm getting from Joe Milton, but I think it's going to be a phenomenal game, Vince. Vince, what do you yeah, think? Yeah, it is going to be a phenomenal game. I think Harbaugh is one of the best coaches, college, NFL. <laughs> You name it, I think he's tremendous, and he's done a good job with that team. They're ready to take the next step. That being said, E.J. Fleck, I mean, he's got him playing. What an unbelievable year last year. Beats Auburn in the bowl game. Did a heck of a job in Western Michigan, and, you know, I, I have no idea either. This will be fun to watch, but I'll go with the sentiment and pick Minnesota. All right, you got a couple Not of Minnesotas, so L.C. Not so fast. <laughs> Not so fast. The two facts I considered when making this pick. One, Minnesota's last win at home was over Michigan 
43 years ago. That's worth you. Michigan has won 20 of the last 21 games played in Minnesota, including 16 straight. That's a second yo. Guess who I'm picking? Yep, I'm going to blue. Go Michigan. <laughs> Victor Valdez. Is it for you, Desmond? Is it for you? Heroes. <laughs> That's for you, Desmond. <laughs> Enjoy your day at college football. Special thanks to Vince Vaughn. Go see Freaky next month. Kirk, real fast, give me the name of the one guy in Ohio State you're going to know tonight. Jackson Smith Enigma. Do not forget him. He'll be a Number star. Number 11. Number 11. <laughs> <laughs>